So today's topic of discussion is how you request a Google review kit from Google so that you can display some of your best reviews or one of them um, in, in your location. So as we've been discussing, you know, these past couple of weeks, um, Google is often the first point of contact between a customer and a business. So whether it's from finding a business nearby, planning itineraries, um, upcoming trips to looking up, you know, a forgotten phone number. Um, we, we always plug into Google to help us with anything that we want to know. <laughs> and so if we want to find out how a business or even too, if we want to find out how a business compares to the other, we look at Google and, and we find out what other people's experiences have been with those specific businesses. So um, Google reviews, of course, has its awesome feature, which allows businesses or users to write reviews directly about that business on Google or Google Maps. And now, um, too, well, it's been a while, but now you can also add photos um, to your reviews to better explain what you're trying to describe about that business. So since reviews are obviously favored <laughs> by the search engines, you can now go to Google and request your review kit from Google. And so here's what it looks like. I'm going to share my screen. Um, okay, so if you go to this link, which is smallthanks.withgoogle.com, I've already added that into the comments. You can request a toolkit. So you can request printed, thing like this from Google <clears throat> of your favorite reviews. So you search for your business. And, and let me make it um, known that you have to have a Google My Business page, <laughs> just in case that question comes up. Then you select on it and it brings you to a link that shows you one of your um, your customized toolkit, you get a free of printed materials by mail, or you can even download this kit, print it yourself, and also share it on your uh, social media sites. Or you can add it as a photo to your Google My Business photos. <laughs> okay, so then it kind of gives you an idea of what your social media image will look like. Let me see if I can enlarge this here. So see, it shows great service, delivering sensational results. It gives you the name of the individual here, it says Martina B, and then the review star, which is five-star reviews, <clears throat> okay? And then look at the bottom here. It also gives a plugin that says, support us with your reviews and photos on Google. So it's also encouraging the individuals that are reviewing this um, uh, to, to leave a review, to support you with a review, okay? This is um, a poster that you will receive that you can place in your office. You can put it in the window. You can put it in one of your high traffic areas so that um, it's there for everyone to see. And it also encourages not only others to leave you a review, but in, it encourages your staff to ask for a review because seven out of 10 people will say yes if you just ask for a review. And then here, is a promotional material which says support us with your reviews and photos on Google. Okay, let me see if I can. Um, so here you can request it by mail. If you just click on that, it'll tell you what's in your toolkit with this, which is a 16 inch by 20 inch poster, a table tent, a sticker and a window cling. And so when you order it, because your Google My Business page is already connected to it, it's going to pre-populate the address and send it directly to that address. You just click on confirm and it sends. Or you can also download this and you can start printing and sharing. So, you know, you can unzip your download, read the tip sheet because it also comes with a tip sheet to learn more about sharing and displaying your, your customized material. <clears throat> the cool thing is, look at this. Okay, so they just uh, created this, this new video where you can share a video of your recent business highlights with your customers. So I'll push play so you can see what that's like. 
hope everybody can hear this. How awesome is that fancy little 34 second video? Okay, so see here, now you can add it to Google Plus. You can click on it, add it over on Facebook. <clears throat> mm, let me share it to my page. Got a few pages here, so let me find the right one. We can put a nice little message. Put a thank you and post it on Facebook here. And there you go. Let's see, we'll go check it out to make sure it's on Facebook because <laughs> I always like to double check everything. Moving a little slow today. <clears throat> Either that or I need more patience, right? <laughs> Maybe it'll show. Well, I guess we'll come back to that. Okay, so then look, if you scroll down, now you have some options to where you can share these reviews as well. So if you click on Facebook, of course, it'll go out to Facebook. You can click on Twitter. It'll transfer over to Twitter. This is what it'll look like. Okay, you can tweet that out. Um, and you can also download it. So once you download it, then you can put that wherever you'd like. You can put it on your website. You could put it um, as your desktop if you're sharing your screen. <laughs> I mean, you, the possibilities are endless. So then you can also request to have it printed. And so this is here as well. Um, uh, and then here's another one to where, you know, you can request support us with your reviews and photos on Google. I mean, you can really send an email and ask somebody to support it and just put your, um, put your photo in there as well. Okay, so let me see if there are any questions. No. All right, no questions. At the bottom of the, um, in the comments of this video, you're going to see the link and just click on that small thanks dot with Google dot com to uh, request your toolkit and it'll show you um, the um, review that it's highlighting. You can also just one more time, real quick, I just want to show you this that you can personalize your to toolkit by tool kit, blah, <laughs> by picking some different ones that pre-populate. And you can choose the layout with the review. And then you can also choose your style and your color because obviously not everybody's gonna have the same color. So you can um, incorporate your business colors into that style as well. See right here at the bottom where it shows the colors. All right, so that is all for today. Um, we are live Monday through Friday here at this time. And we discuss, this week we're discussing online reviews. Next week is local SEO. 
And the week after that is Google uh, My Business. I'm also going to add a link for you to download um, a case study that we have in regards to a property management company that has, hmm, let me see, I'm, I'm dropping that link in here so that I don't forget about it. <laughs> um, so anyway, so if you click on the link, you can download and read the case study below on how to, on, to learn how a property management company got over 371 reviews on Google, got on the first position on Google Maps, and generated over 103 inbound leads per month from the search engines. And as always, if you have any questions, because we are here to help um, answer any questions that you have, send us a message at m.me forward slash accelerate marketing. I've also included that in the comments. Create a great rest of your day, everyone.